The Miami Dolphins must find a quality backup quarterback for Tua Tagovailoa this offseason. Options are not great but there has to be someone, Miami learned the hard way this year. It isn't easy. Teddy Bridgewater was nothing special or even average. Whatever Chris Greer and company saw in him as a potential free agent addition, was a mistake. It's a mistake they cannot make again in 2023, the question is, who is the best option for the Dolphins that can step and play at a level that the Dolphins need should to miss a couple of weeks for any reason? So I now present to you. Derek Carr, Carr had a really bad year this year. That is why he got benched in Las Vegas. The expectations were high for Carr coming into this season since the Raiders acquired his former college teammate Devontae Adams. To put it nicely, he did not meet those expectations, that does not mean that he is a bad quarterback. He is one of the most underrated quarterbacks in the NFL, if you give Derek Carr consistency he can be an elite quarterback. In the midst of the train wreck that the Raiders have been since he showed up he has been a fringe top 10 quarterback. Putting Carr in the Mike McDaniel system with weapons like Tyreek Hill and Jalen Waddell he can be one of the five best quarterbacks in the AFC, now we have to look at what it will cost for Carr and whether or not it is worth it, the Raiders want a first round pick. I do not think that they will get that for Carr, Carr can do everything well in Tua's absence, the Dolphins will not have to accept defeats like last season when Tua was injured. Carr in South Beach will bring stability and a level of play that the Dolphins haven't had since Dan Marino. I'm not saying he's as good as Marino, Carr isn't even as good as Tua but he has the stability that Tua doesn't have he would be the most suitable backup QB the Dolphins are looking for.